Alright, what is going on my soldier gaming? It is I your commander in chief, Warzone 157, and welcome to another episode of Warzone Talks. If you're new to my channel, then welcome. I hope you all enjoy, and here's the rundown of this series. I find some of the best, yet small and well undeserved YouTube content creators out there, and I help them out, just giving them a boost of notoriety, and hopefully in the future, I can encourage them to do the same thing in helping other small YouTube channels out because I'm just still in that same percent. I'm still trying to get my name heard, and I'm doing all I can to help others out. And then, you know, some of that stuff comes back on me. As thanks, as, as subs as well. But, right now what you're seeing is the first three to four minutes of absolute madness. Madness, I tell you, in Halo Combat Evolve multiplayer. And if you want to have a raging inducing rage inducing sorry but hilarious fun time play one of these old style maps you'll have so much fun even though it'll annoy you sometimes but enough of this let's go on with the shadows then we'll come back to it first off we have joe axel gaming he has 50 subs he's a gamer and let's player and a vlogger at sometimes he doesn't do a whole lot of vlogs just sometimes we like it if he's annoyed with something and he just wants to vent that's what i do i vent either to myself to other people or wars on talks haha <laughs> but yeah he's an awesome guy just talk to him a little bit and yeah before i say anything else guys go easy on him he just started out start don't just look at his stuff think oh he's just bad if you don't like it just leave don't leave any negative comments on his stuff don't dislike it if you want to talk to him about what he does in the video just send him some feedback comment some feedback so here's something that would help you out you know you got we gotta stick together in this whole time thing because I know man with some of my videos that I've done even recent videos I look at like why did I say that why did I do that what was I thinking he's gonna have that too I still have it it's a always occurring thing. If you help him out, good. If he doesn't want to take your advice and goes on with his stuff, oh well. If that's what he wants to do. It's his YouTube channel. He can do whatever the hell he wants with it. Next up, we have the Randomer Gaming. He has 127 subs. He's a gamer, but he does a lot of GTA 5 and actually no, actually that's pretty much what he does. Yeah, he plays a lot of GTA 5, but he does a lot of montages about. You know him or some people failing or some other people winning at doing stunts and he does them in like awesome montages the last one that i saw from him was called penetration why is it called penetration i'm not sure i looked at the video don't really understand the concept of the title but you know what it latched on to me just the title alone latched on to me and i just i, I was there and i enjoyed every single thing like some of the things that he he's done on that video I was like, how do I do that? You know, I might give that a try. Dude. Either I got blown up. I died. Or I didn't even get close off to the freaking starting line because of just getting like rubber band. And this wasn't on online. This was in freaking single player. I'm like, what the hell is going on? But I don't know. There's probably a bug that's going on in the Xbox One version of GTA 5. But the game's still fun. I love it. Next thing we know, or you know, that I know, and you sure shall know, is Waffle Army. He has 43 subs. He's British. I love British people to death. His commentary is so amazing. It's like it's so... What is the word I'm looking for? Damn, I can't remember the word I was going to use for it, but it was going to be good. I'm sorry, dude. If I when, I when I think about it, I'll say it. But I love how he enunciates his words. He's very proper sounding I like it. it latches on to me that's why I like it if I understand what it says I'm already hooked he plays a lot of Minecraft and Counter-Strike he has to play this one game that I looked at it's called Mine of Duty which is just like Call of Duty except in Minecraft form it takes two shots of somebody to somebody to kill him and uh, 
people can't shoot for shit. Because <laughs> a lot of people are getting wrecked in that mode. But if I had a PC, a good, fast, working gaming PC, I would be all over that crap. And this is going to be the last one. And you all know, and people who don't know, but shall know, right now, every single time I go to the last YouTuber, they always get the celebrity section. And today, I have for you, Isabel Miss V Plam. Now, I thought it was V P I M, but you know, I had to look at it differently. I had to look at the video. Oh, it's not V P I M. Oh, okay, it's V Plam. Okay, gotcha. She has a 500 and four subscribers, me being one of them, and as all well as everyone else that I've given shout outs to. She's Hispanic. I'm not going to say what part of any type of Hispanic country or state because I really don't know. I don't want to get it wrong, get ethnicities mixed up, and have some people rage. So I'm just going to say she's Hispanic, she speaks Spanish, and she also does English subs on the side so she can also communicate with people of a different language of English if you don't know Spanish. And she's also a vlogger and a cover artist, which means she can sing and she also plays the piano of some songs that she already knows. And she's also a marketer. She just graduated college for the major of marketing. Now she's done a lot of small jobs who need people of her expertise, but you know, they haven't been too appealing to her. But if you guys need somebody to market stuff for you or you need or if you have probably someone who would want someone like her, by all means, let her know in the comment section of her videos. I never know. I might help somebody out one day getting a big opportunity. And that's just not for me. It's anybody else. We always try to help people out, you know, so they can help, you know, gain a little bit more help. And then that help comes back on you. So everybody wins. And that's going to be it for these shout outs. If you want a shout out, by all means, guys and gals, leave me your video channel or your YouTube channel, sorry, in the comment section below. Let me know why you started your YouTube channel, what you use it for, and what do you do on it. Now, I just want to go with a quick update on my Let's Ask the Community series. I might not even use that title anymore. I'll let you guys know if it changes. But I have three more components I have to buy in order to, you know, have you guys hear my commentary and also hear people in my game chat. Because if you don't already know, if you want to hear people's commentary in either the PS4 or the Xbox One, you're going to have to use separate microphones. Now here's the thing, it works for the PS4, but it's very iffy on the Xbox One. If you have to use the Kinect, you can. That's the you know quickest and easy way. But you might have echoing effects that could you know jeopardize your video in some way. Not with the you know getting it correct. I'm just saying if you have something in the background, it could probably show up on the video as well. But if you get like some splicers and a different adapter to the controller that you can plug into the controller of the Xbox One and then use other devices which I will be doing a setup when it when my stuff comes in pretty much you do your little know-how and you can still hear people while still having your headset in and still getting the recording game chat now it's a lot of stuff I think that the USB microphones would help for the Xbox One as well but I think you know all this stuff from next gen consoles has just been overlooked they did some of the good things that they wanted to do inside but things that were also good in the old gen they kind of overlooked it and never got into the programming which it happens all the time you know you can't do anything about it as long as you can just you know try to update it and update it good but what do you guys think of the next gen consoles? Do you think they're pushing the boundaries of some of the games, some of the engines that are, you know, 
buffing out games like this, do you think that old gen games coming in with new gen games will, you know, do you think it's holding the engine back of doing more stuff? I'm kind of, like, I want my channel not just to be a channel of gaming, I want it to be an interactive channel, which means if you guys have any questions, I can try to answer them, and if I have any questions, you guys can try to answer them. You know, start friendships online. Like, fuck Facebook, fuck Skype, fuck all that other stuff. Come to YouTube. That's the best thing. <laughs> uh, I don't even know. That, that could probably be the downfall of many YouTube channels. <laughs> But if I have to say anything else before this, you know, video is over, this game is good. Only flaw, it takes a little too long to get in games. Hit detection is kind of good unless, you know, the servers, you know, make the balancing of everyone's connection, you know, a little wonky. But above all, still a fun game. Always have fun playing it. Now, a short review of the multiplayer. Uh, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare don't get me wrong it's still fun to play as well but I don't like the new melee mechanic because it's broken they can hit air they can hit the wall and they still can kill you even though you already passed them it's like they do the rubber band effect you go forward up oh, they'll pull you back and kill you doesn't make any sense there's no lunge to the knifing but there's a lunge to the mechanic of the punching which really irates me another thing is i love how they took the pick 13 or pick 12 from black ops 2 and put it in their game but at the same time they also you know copied if you ask me i think they copied and the attachments that you need you have to be an absolute try hard to get which you know as well pisses me off but it's still a good game not knocking it guns are cool looking but I will do a bigger review in the next few videos that I do. Not sure when I'm going to do it. But I hope you guys enjoy. If you like what you see, be my personal firing squad and murder the like button if you have a YouTube channel or you know someone else who has a YouTube channel. Let me know in the comment section below. If this was like the best video that you've seen thus far, please add to your favorites and let people know what I do for this channel on any social network that you use. And if you want to become a soldier in my army today, please subscribe to stay updated. And as always, this is Warzone 157. Reminding you to keep your eyes on the prize and finger on the trigger at all times. This is going to be in my transmission for the time being. I'm going to actually start doing some more Alien Isolation, but first, do some more Far Cry 4, Halo, Combat Evolved, and I think there was another one. Far Cry 4, Halo, Combat Evolved, and... Oh yeah, last one, Far Cry 4. Don't know if I said that or not. Alright, so it's Alien Isolation, Far Cry 4, and Assassin's Creed, and the Master Chief Collection. So there you go. And as always, have a good day from wherever you are. Morning, noon, night, UK, Germany, Asia, Mexico, whatever. Good day or night. And as always, my ladies and gentlemen, Soldiers of Gaming, Warzone out.